This is Team Interplanetar from Bangladesh University of Engineering and Technology presenting to you the latest rover of our team, Mongol E version 3. This year, our team has been divided into five subgroups, which are mechanical, electrical, communication, AI, and science tests. For the mechanical part, we have used CNC technology for precise machining of our custom designed wheel. We have used 6061 aluminum alloy for the wheel structure, which has greater strength but lightwell and portable at the same time. After extensive study of Terra mechanics, we have modified the wheel design from its previous one. The suspension was completely designed in solidwares and intense stress analysis was conducted prior to fabrication. 3mm aluminum sheet was used for better stability, durability and lightweight at the same time. We have implemented counterlink mechanism for the suspension so that the rover can overcome any sort of obstacle with ease. We have tested the rover on our own made version of terrain similar to the condition of the main arena. The suspension is coupled with the main chassis made of square SS channels. The manipulator of the rover has 6 degree of freedoms with infinite rotation of the end effector using DC check mechanism. It can lift weights up to 7 kg with great stability. This time, we have used inverse kinematics for controlling the manipulator to perform various tasks such as turning a crank, opening a latch, toggling a switch, opening a drawer, pressing mechanical keyboard precisely, operating a joystick and turning a knob. We have used four cameras including two of them mounted on the end effector for better viewing angle while performing the tasks. We have made custom designed individual PCBs for wheel motors, the manipulator, communication devices and onboard science tasks. For the communication part, we have used 900 MHz frequency band for data transmitting and 5.8 GHz frequency band for video transmitting. The rover is capable of computing the shortest path between two waypoints using GPS data from the onboard GPS module. After reaching each predefined coordinate, the rover will start to find the tennis ball using a pre-trained ball classifier which is done by convolutional neural network algorithm. A cluster of Raspberry Pi 3 has been used for processing the deep learning algorithm. For obstacle avoidance in the course of autonomous navigation, this year we are using a Kinect sensor for close range 3D mapping and a leader module for overall 2D mapping of the obstacles. Then the data from Kinect and leader were merged for simultaneous localization and mapping the environment. For science mission, we 3D printed two specially designed reaction chambers for fully onboard chemical testing and investigation of nutrients and microbiological sign in soil samples. The chambers are fully automated and capable of bust and fissile detection. An isolated and sealed mixing chamber is used which is capable of making soil solution in a perfect ratio. We have done specific lab experiments to validate our methodology. An auger soil sampler consists of soil temperature sensor, moisture sensor and digital microscope simultaneously collect and analyze soil characteristics and grain structure. After mixing the soil sample, the vials with previously inserted testing reagents change their positions automatically. By sensing the color change of the sample, rover will determine the availability of various nutrients like N, P, K and microorganisms in the soil. Gas, humidity and UV sensors are mounted on the rover to determine the atmospheric conditions of a specific site and send the data to the base station. Analyzing the data, the rover will make decision about the presence of extinct and extinct life.